What did Bradley get right over the summer? Oh, yeah. Zay Jones going to be a thing. Zay Jones, five for 55 and a touchdown. It was a beautiful catch, by the way. Zay Jones, also the 13th best PFF receiving grade among wide receivers. Yeah. I said, if you remember from last week, I said, pick up Zay Jones. And I'm going to say, pick up Zay Jones again because he's still on your waiver wire and he's still playing a significant amount of snaps. So you should be picking him up. Zay Jones played one fewer pass snap than Calvin Ridley. He ran the same percentage of routes as Calvin Ridley. This is a player who's going to play majority on the outside, about 30% in the slot, 60% plus in out wide. Calvin Ridley is our outside wide receiver, but Christian Kirk is the one who comes off the field during two wide receiver sets. It's going to be Zay Jones and it's going to be Calvin Ridley on the outside for Trevor Lawrence. And plus it's Christian Kirk. Who's competing for targets now with Evan Ingram. Hmm. So nevertheless, you need to be picking up Zay Jones again because his role was confirmed to us in week one. He was a producer. He got five targets, caught all five of them for the touchdown, 55 yards. And he is in a deeper league in your 12, 16 team multi flex leagues. He is a flex play for us week in, week out. And I said that the Jaguars offense was going to be ascending and Zay Jones is going to be coming along with it. So I like Zay Jones again. And we'll just continue to ride the Zay Jones, the Zay Jones train until, until the end of the season, until we find out otherwise. And as people like to hear from me, the, the, I do I give the people what they want, right? <laughs> and as I like to say, it's better to Zay too much than not Zay what you need to Zay. If you like the content and find this helpful, make sure you hit that red subscribe button. Really helps the channel, 